<laughs> Dick Yu is on a mission. He wants to make Hong Kong's 7 million residents laugh. He trained as a hypnotherapist, but then came across laughter yoga, which originated in India. After training in Taiwan, he set up the territory's first laughter club in 2007. People look at you as if you are crazy, if you always laugh. But after taking up laughter yoga, I no longer think that way. I just laugh without worrying about what other people think. Hong Kong is one of the world's most densely populated cities. The Asian financial hub has some of the worst income disparities and very stressful workplaces. Researchers warn that far too many people sacrifice their health for the pursuit of wealth. And then they have to spend their wealth trying to fix their health. So instead of squeezing the last blood from the employers, give them a good salary, a good holiday, a good working place, and then it will be at the end of the day, everybody will, happy, will be happy. It's a win-win situation. Laughing may be contagious, but scientists say it is actually good for your health. It increases blood flow, reduces stress hormones, and boosts the immune system. It also helps trigger the release of endorphins, the body's natural painkillers. The laughter club should be like a convenience store, which you have in every community. If everyone is laughing, society will be happier. Dick Yu has set up 11 laughter clubs all over Hong Kong, and they are all free. A good laugh in good company may not fix all the world's problems. But it certainly helps. <laughs>